right, we're going to find the area of each of the following figures. All figures are made up of rectangles. That helps us out because rectangles, we can find the area by doing what? What do we do to find the area of a rectangle? Everybody. Length 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 length. Length. We take the length and we multiply it by the width and that gives us the area. So let's try that for these two. They've actually split this up for us. And we have this up here and this down here. I've got one side measurement, but I don't have a side measurement here. So I cannot multiply anything until I figure this out. I know, what do we call this when we say it's the same thing across the way? What do we call it? Twins across the street. Twins across the street, that helps out, right? So I know this um, width is the same thing as this down here, and it split it up for us. What should I do with these two numbers? Yes, add them. Add them. So I know two plus three equals? Five. Five. So I know the um, width right here is five centimeters, and because all of this is five centimeters. So now I have my two side lengths for this rectangle. What is my area for this part of it? Yes, 10. ten. I know two times five equals five. 10. Okay, 10 what? Ten. Potatoes? Square centimeters. centimeters. <laughs> Square centimeters, thank you. Now I need to find out the area of this rectangle. Looks like a square, which can be a rectangle. Um, yes, what do I do? Um, And multiply them. I know my side length. Three times three is nine. 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 I'm done. No. 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 What do I need to do? What's the last little part I have to do? Everybody, tell me. What do I have to do? Add. 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 I have to add the two areas together. So I know that's ten plus nine. What does that equal? Nineteen. 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 Ninete